Okay, so here we're going to do another uh, problem related to the equation of a tangent line, and this is kind of a very common type of problem. So uh, you've got some function, in this case square root of x. Uh, it turns out that the derivative of square root of x is 1 over 2 times the square root of x. And what we want to do is we want to find the point on the graph, and maybe there's more than one. In this case, there actually won't be, but uh, we're going to find the point uh, x, y, so that the tangent line to the graph has a slope equal to 1 over 18. So again, we're trying to figure out, again, you know, where on the original graph would the tangent line have some particular slope. And to do this, it's easy, um, in a sense, and once you have the derivative, because uh, again, the derivative basically tells you, for, tells you a formula for the slope of the tangent line. And it says, well, our formula for the slope of the tangent line uh, at any particular x-coordinate is given by 1 over 2 times the square root of x. And well, we want that to equal 1 over 18. So all we have to do in this case is just solve the uh, equation 1 over 2 square root of x equals 1 over 18. So uh, to do this, uh, to solve this equation, this is one that's not, not too bad. Um, typically, anytime I have a fraction on both sides, I just cross multiply. So uh, we can do 1 times 18, that'll give us 18. And then we can do, well, uh, 1 times 2 square root of x, that'll just give us, well, 2 square root of x. We can divide both sides by 2. So by 2, 18 over 2 is 9. On the right, we still are just left with the square root of x. Well, to solve for x, all we would need to do now is just square both sides. So on the right side, we're left with x. And 9 times 9 is going to be 81. So uh, if you graph the original function, square root of x, recall square root of x looks something like that. And what we've done is we've gone over to the x-coordinate of 81. So it says at the x-coordinate of 81, uh, it says the slope of that tangent line is going to be uh, 1 over 18. OK, so we're almost there. Um, the question uh, actually asks for, we want the, the x and the y-coordinate on the original uh, function. Well, again, if, you, if you're using the square root function, if you plug 81 in, the square root of 81 is just 9. So this point will be 81, comma, 9. So again, all we're doing is we're taking our x-coordinate. We're not putting it into the derivative, but we're putting it into the original function. So again, if you take the square root of 81, again, we get 9. So it says the point that we're looking for would be the point 81, comma, 9. So again, it's common. Uh, they'll, you'll try to figure out where, um, you know, you'll try to figure out points on the graph where the tangent line equals some number. A lot of times we'll, we'll try to figure out where the tangent line equals zero, and you'll see that um, in a few sections. That turns out to kind of be an important question. But again, that's all there is to it in this case. Just take the derivative, set it equal to the slope that you want. That'll give you the x-coordinate. Plug the x-coordinate back into the original function to find the corresponding y-value.